Hugo, Oklahoma. It's going to be an awesome time. Stay tuned. We love going on lots of adventures. We might have to do some things different than others. But it doesn't stop us from exploring this beautiful world God has sent us. Like and subscribe and follow Old Johnny. So today we are at Awesome Adventures in Hugo, Oklahoma. And today we are staying in Mills Mansion. Come inside and I'll show you our room. boys are there? Two. How many elephants are there? But they didn't know. I know. There were two of us somehow. No, I know those are yours. Really? Both of them are for me? One's for you and one's for Bubba. Yay! <laughs> How fun is this? So we're going to unpack and then uh, go check out the elephants. So we just got all those stuff unloaded and they said that we could walk or drive around and look at the elephants. So we're going to walk around and see the elephants. Um, we can't go up to the gate, but we can stay on the gravel. So that's what we're going to do. No clue what the morning held.
We got all set up for a good night's sleep. We couldn't wait till the morning. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good Guys, thank you. <laughs> Billy, what just happened? I got 
breakfast, a staff member took us around to meet all the elephants and tell us all those stories. It was so much fun. It looks pretty dry, actually. I just, if we get stuck, we'll get one of the elephants to get him. It's the only thing I'll run from. Flies and stings, I don't want anything to do with it. Like I said, she will try to get you to feed over that Always. Here, Viola. Oh, yeah. Oh, maybe. Hi, my love. <laughs> no knocking, Viola. That's why I think that too. Is the iPad in the way or something? Huh? His chair's not going up. He needs to be taller. Yeah. <laughs> and that command I just gave her was they check out like <laughs> objects, but she knows what it is. She we Hi. have a wheelchair, we roll around them. Leave it alone, Viola. <laughs> Don't touch it. Yeah, look. She's it's just right trying here. to see Come any on. treats. Come on, get it. He yeah. has it. It's okay. So they, uh, they roll around the mud to put oh. some protection. Yeah, it's just, it helps regulate their body heat and like see like all the hay on their back. Uh -huh. Yeah, it also helps right with here. the flies. Oh. Right so here. they can feel flies land on their skin, mm -hmm. but <laughs> the only flies that yeah, can bite into their, yeah, into their tissue would be a horse. Get close to her. Yeah, yeah. mosquitoes can penetrate their skin on their ears and around their eyes and at the end of their trunk, yeah. but everywhere else, no. the, they're not long enough. Hold your head up. Lala. Hold your head up, Viola is a sweetheart, but she's also the largest elephant, or the largest female here. She weighs a little bit over 11. I'll tell you 10,000, but she weighs over a little, a little over 11. Hi. I'm pretty sure. Look Last at that we smile. Her, she was like 10, 6. <laughs> so she's got to be over 11 by now because she's gotten bigger. COVID 19. <laughs> We feel you, sweetheart. We feel you. She, she eats so much. <laughs> Do you like yeah, it's a you? shoe. Do you like his house shoe? That's his knee. Yeah. That's his tail. <laughs> That's how he drives it. Yeah, she's trying to get more treats out of you. <laughs> She'll try to get as many as she can. But... <laughs> That's why I set the treats down over here because and told her no knocking because they'll tap on an object trying to figure out what it is. And she did that to a guy in a wheelchair whenever she was in this enclosure mm. one day. And uh, it was all a ploy. They're very sneaky, very crafty. She was just wanted that whole tray of treats. Uh, she got the whole tray of treats. You? Because <laughs> I stepped in between them. I'm like, no. And as soon as I turn to tell them what she's doing, she grabs the edge of the tray and tipped all the treats out. Um. <laughs> You're naughty. You can't keep her from eating them. They can lift a third of their body weight with their trunk yeah. alone. Like, their trunk's very strong. Are you naughty? Yeah. That's when they had them move logs in the Asian. Yep, yeah, so they pretty. used them in the bulldozers. But she, uh, <laughs> she Here, Laura. Some people. She might not know what that is, as it was moving. <laughs> <laughs> she can't lift her trunk up that high. Uh, what causes that? Partial trunk paralysis. Uh, it just happens over time. Hello. Pushing down trees and stuff like that. So they damage the nerves right here because whenever an elephant pushes down a tree, they curl their trunk under and it, they like flex all the muscles in their trunk. And I mean, it is, it feels like you're tapping on this whenever they do it. 
<laughs> so then they just ram them over and over and over. So she probably did a lot of that whenever she was younger and not on the road. Because of course, whenever the elephants in the circus were on the road, they got to relax. Like they would take them, I've seen pictures and stuff of them, if they were passing through a river, if there's any way that the semi truck could pull over and park somewhere, they would take the elephants down to the river and swim with them and stuff. That's I've gotten to awesome. swim with the elephants uh, at our, they call it a pond, but it's a lake. Uh, it's spring fed, it has a concrete spillway. It's a, <laughs> But I've Here. gotten to swim with the elephants in that. Uh, of course, we have a this little creek that runs through. Back. We had an amazing time, and we would definitely recommend you try it out too. We got a Groupon um, to do this, and since we got a Groupon, the price has already increased. So if this is something that you're thinking about doing, I would definitely hop on before it comes even more popular, so you can get a better deal.